Hello my lovely humans and welcome back to another fabulous renovation here on my channel and I can't wait to show you guys what we have in store today. So this is a very very small house in Oasis Springs that I'm renovating for my flyaway save. If there's any echoing that you didn't hear now but you do now it's because I cleaned up my room I'll explain more in the actual renovation coming up very shortly. So we go through these front doors and I built myself a family that's going to be living here so I can personalize it to my touch. And this living room's small, it's quaint, but there's a lot of kids and stuff. I think there's like one kid actually, and I think I think there's one kid. And then um, this is the dining room. I honestly don't really like the dining room. I mostly don't like the back of the dining room. I think the kitchen could be out here instead of in the area where the kitchen is, which we'll show you in a second. This is the one kid bedroom, which I actually believe that I might change. Um, I don't know how much the floor plan I'm actually going to change, but there's a few front time things that we'll talk about. Um, they have one bathroom. It's kind of small. I think they have one. They might actually have two now that I'm thinking about it. This would be the master bedroom, which um, we have come so much further than this, so I wouldn't worry too much about that. And then, is this another bathroom? Oh, it is a bathroom. Okay. So then we have a bathroom over here and the backyard patio, which I said I'm probably not going to mess with. I'll probably maybe change some small things, but that's about it for the actual house. But the big thing that I'm going to be changing is this wall right here. I always think it's so ugly. So we're just going to figure out how to rearrange the house around that one wall, basically. <laughs> um, I wish I was joking, but I'm really not. So just be, yeah. Oh, wow. Yep, there we go. And yeah, that explains the whole house. And they do have an animal, and so we're going to try to incorporate an animal into this. But this is the floor plan, and of course right now we're going to jump straight into it. Okay guys, this is my first time doing a renovation in a very, very, very long time. I had so much fun. I really liked how this one turned out too, so that's very exciting. And I was going to use Adobe Prem Pro because I got it today. It was um, a graduation gift, which I'm going to talk about in a minute, graduation. And I just, I don't, I don't know how to use it, and so I'm back to my normal editor. And I will just teach myself in time. But we're here. I am talking to you guys. I'm so excited. There's a lot to talk about, um, such as why I took time off for so long. And that has a lot to do with I didn't have a good um, recording software. Me and OBS didn't get along. Um, and then I tried to stream and it just didn't work. So now I am streaming almost, I streamed for like six hours today. And then I did this. And so I'm playing like a lot of Sims. And it's, oh my gosh. Guys, I don't, I forgot how much I needed it in my life. Um, it was weird how much I needed it in my life, to be honest with you. Because I'm so not stressed out as much as I was, like, like, I don't know, two days ago. I was so stressed out. But I played Sims for so long today. I played Sims for four hours, plus another hour and a half doing this. And it was like the best time ever. I mean, I just, I can't believe I forgot how much fun this was. And I was just talking to my sister, like, not even, like, I don't know, a few days ago, about how, oh, I wish, you know, I enjoyed it more. And she's like, oh, yeah, I wish I enjoyed it more as well. And we were, like, super excited for Seasons, obviously, which comes out at the end of next month. And so, like, we're counting down days. But, like, I'm, I also have, like, a lot of stressful things that are coming up, you know, next weekend in particular. I have my orientation, which is just, oh my gosh, it's intense. I don't know how I feel about that. Um, it's a day and a half, and I just, I honestly just don't know how I'm going to handle it. But I'll figure it out. I mean, I have to be able to handle that to handle, you know, actually going to school. So, yeah. But on that note, another reason is because it was so stressful because I had exams and everything. And so, like, it just didn't all work out pretty nicely at that moment. And I always end up going back and doing it when I'm so stressed out that I can't handle it. So that has a lot to do with it, is that I just, I realized I couldn't handle it. But now I'm here and it's summer and I'm in love with everything I'm doing. And I can't wait to build tomorrow. I think that's on my agenda. Actually, I'm building twice because I'm supposed to be building a house for my live stream. Um, whatever time I live stream, I think it's going to be... I think it's going to be a nighttime live stream, like from 6 to 9, I think is when I'm going to do it, or like 5 to 9, I'm not sure, but tomorrow, and then, or, well, actually, it's going to be like, 
you know, when you see this, it's going to be, like, at that night, you know, like, in the evening time. Yeah. Okay. Glad we had the conversation. And then, um, also, on top of that, you know, I had to build um, a house for the weekend, which I've not done yet, which I'm super excited to build. I'm just, I'm really excited to get back in The Sims. I don't know. I had to take a long break and just play my current household, and I just needed a, I needed a break from my current household, to be honest with you. And then I had to record another current household update for the month of May, and I have nothing for you. So I had to build a house for them, so I'm pretty sure that's the house that's coming first. Yeah, I need to, I have to build three houses this week. Oh my gosh, that's ridiculous. And like two of them has to be recorded. Poof, okay, it's gonna be fun. But I had so much fun doing this house in particular. It's one of my new favorites, of course. Um, I'm making a flyaway save, which is supposed to be coming out in the next like month and a half or so. Luckily enough, Seasons doesn't come without a new world. Um, I'm just going to have to figure out how to intimate Seasons into that. Because it's probably going to come out in July at some point is the goal. Which brings me on to the second video, which is going up at 4 or 3.30. I haven't decided yet. On every Tuesday is only getting a second video. And we're going to make over the... I have like 40 townies to make over left. And their families or whatever. I'm not making over them all on here just like i'm not making over every house on here um i think there's gonna be a few like bigger ones that i think i might want to take time with that i'm going to do on live stream and the same thing with townies is that townies that i just don't think are going to do well or that i just don't particularly like and i just need to make them over i'm going to do them on um live stream as well so if you want to check that out i my live stream channel i can't really say the t word um because youtube doesn't like it but i'm not really big so i'm going to say it. my twitch channel is of course linked down below in the description or whatever and then also today this morning um at noon this morning went up my reaction to seasons which of course i re already technically try to react to it was a hassle but now we reacted to it and it was great and i loved it and yeah so that's gonna happen i'm still not really sure what i'm going to do with it to be honest with you um for my live reactions, I mean, I'm going to have my cast videos and my gameplay video, but I don't know if I'm just going to have, like, a gameplay video, like, I had a world overview of Brindleton Bay for Cats and Dogs, because I don't have a series, I really, I don't have Sims I really want to play with, and I'm not really ready to get attached to a whole new, like, set of Sims yet, family-wise, because it's going to be, like, you know, family play and everything, and so it's, like, Tribbles 2.0 without Tribbles. Yeah, I was thinking about maybe doing a single dad's let's play and using Max and their daughter as it and like continuing on their life afterwards. I think that would be really fun. And so I'm really into that. So fingers crossed that I do that. I gotta go visit that save, see if it still works. But yeah, um, super excited. If so, maybe that will happen. We can do like a single dad's. But I've already done a single mom let's play. You know what I mean? So I don't need like a single dad's let's play on top of it. I'm not sure. We'll see. The family that lives here, by the way, is a very interesting and unique family. I just got done right before um, I did the interior. I want to make sure I understood their creativity and their work and everything. And so they're all maxed out. They're all skill-wise and meeting friends and everything. Great set of people. Very big fan of them. I thought it was a really cute family that I ended up creating here. And I do make some house changes as we go forward, especially the four wind changes a lot. And I love how I mentioned in the beginning that I'm not going to really make a big floor plan, yet then it just like forms into like everything else, you know. But I think it turns out really nice and I'm very, very happy with it. Now I'm going to talk about graduation for the next like four minutes or so because it was um, an experience and I think that I need to talk about because on a few other videos I was like freaking out about. So on Thursday of this past week, I had practice graduation, which I had a horrible like panic attack about on Wednesday. <laughs> went to a mental breakdown with one of my best friends and um then on Thursday it happened and it was very stressful because I didn't have the right clothes or whatever but as soon as it like got going it like was over you know so that was great and then um so then it was just like a waiting game to graduation and I fall at everything I have many stories on here on my YouTube channel especially during these videos of me telling you how I fell during like gym class because I fall all the time, okay? It just, it's just a thing that happens to me. And I I just, I accepted it and I moved on. Isn't that, isn't that huge? Like way too big? Because I just thought it was way too big. And so I thought I was gonna fall because I fall at everything. And so they line us up 
um, and they do head count, and then they minus again at two, and so it's like 40 minutes later after head count, and no joke, I'm not even joking, like at all, I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna fall walking in there, I didn't fall, I was like, okay, I'm gonna fall getting in my seat, didn't fall, then like the ceremony took forever, I mean, it was forever, and so that was, you know, it was just long, and then they started calling our names, and I got up, and like the whole row in front of me messed up their seating arrangements, and so like I thought I was gonna mess up mine, and we ended up actually doing okay, because we had some people helping us to make sure we didn't mess up, um, and it turned out pretty nice, and I didn't fall getting my diploma, which was great, it's actually not that bad of experience, and I think it was pretty good, and I think, um, if you haven't gone to graduation yet, I think it's a great experience, and I can't wait for you to experience it yourself. Um, so yeah, that's my, my spiel about graduation. Um, unlike prom this year, I enjoyed it a lot more. I did see some faces I didn't want to see, but ultimately it's going to happen anyways, so, I mean, what can I do? And then prom, also really good, except for, like, the last, like, 40 minutes of prom. It was really bad. And I left early. <laughs> but what can you do, right? You just gotta live your life, guys. <laughs> just, <laughs> I was on high school. <laughs> and then, um, do you want to talk about how I failed my final exam? Because I did for Spanish class. I still passed the B, so, like, it's not a problem. But I failed it. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> I mean, she was, she gave me a hug. And, like, I could see how proud she was on my face. And, I don't know, it was just a moment. Because... Like this teacher has seen me evolve as both a student in her class and like a leader in like drama because she's my director and I took on the role of a head this year for a whole year and sure the first half of the year I asked a lot of questions but the second half I was like no we're gonna make the decisions ourselves and we're just gonna make sure they're okay with her because like it was much more of like her play the first one she was probably like I don't care second one she was like I care about every detail <laughs> which was nice I guess but also kind of stressful and it was just it was really nice to see the proud look in her face of like you made it and I'm so happy that you made it type thing also I think it's where like oh thank god you want to take like a class of mine because she mentioned she's like and you took like two of my Spanish classes and I was like um I took three technically but we don't count the first one I guess even though I got a B minus in it and you didn't let me go okay it's fine no one's judging you. Um, but I love her death. And then, in like a non, like, you know, weird way. And then, oh, never mind. Guys, if you like this video, please give me a big fat thumbs up. I'm, we could continue talking for like an hour. I'm used to it. So, um, <laughs> if you like this video, please give me a big fat thumbs up. Don't comment down below. Hit the subscribe button. And of course, the screenshots are coming along with some happy birthday music. And then my outro, of course. I'll see you guys all next time. Love you all. Bye-bye.